god. What's up with this? Every blog you visit is either about naked chicks or pregnant girls. I mean, come on, isn't there anything more to tell people about your life, or what's happening in your life, than this constant nagging about your baby or infant child? Now, don't get me wrong, I love children, I really do, I think they're wonderful. But you don't have to put it up on the internet like you're the only one in the world who is gonna have a baby or are pregnant at this moment. I know you're proud of it, and that's good. But quit terrorizing us by updating your blog endlessly about your stomach every single day. Well, so now you may wonder, why do I talk about this when we should be talking about games? Well, since I'm kind of irritated by this, we're gonna try to do some kind of horrid experiment to blow up some steam. Let's find out if we can find a game where we can, in fact, kill some babies. Well, the first game I found when I went through my collection was a game called Baby Boomer. Well, it's a baby on the cover with a fucking cobra, spider and a bat try to eat the living shit out of the baby. I guess. I hope so. So let's give it a try, shall we? Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you, this is an unlicensed game by Color Dreams. That's why it's blue and weird, and I don't expect it to be any good. Okay, this game is a really shit stain in my library, but there is a cool function with the game. You apparently can play with two players, one playing with a Nintendo controller and the other one with a Nintendo Zapper. Unfortunately, I tried to do that, but it seems that my Zapper doesn't work at all, so I won't be able to show you that. And no, I didn't play it on my big screen LCD TV, so it's not because of that. Anyway, the main goal of the game is to shoot everything. But not the baby! That's a bummer. You need to clear the path for the baby so it can crawl home to its mother or something like that. Well, that wasn't really what I expected or did want to play. But if we already started the game, let's do a quick review about it. There are tons of shit that you need to hit for this to work. Everything from enemies as rats, snakes and monsters to clouds, so they can drop snowflakes and freezes the gaps where you can fall down. Also, you got some kind of power stamina controlled by a milk meter that keeps running out. For it not to run out, you need to shoot milk bottles to make it last. Some of them seem to be invisible sometimes, or maybe it's just a glitch. I don't know, and I couldn't care less. There are yellow milk bottles too, and I don't want to guess what's there inside. But you get invisible for a brief moment, so there is some way to make the game easier. It gets boring very fast, but that doesn't mean that this is too easy. For success, the best way is just to keep blasting your gun all over the screen to try to shoot everything there is to hit. And no, you still can't shoot the fucking baby. If you get hit by an enemy, or if the baby falls down a gap, it just starts crying and you lose a life. No life bar, and even worse, no goddamn continues. Free lives and that's it. I had enough of this game, but when I come to think of it, how the hell did the baby get out in the first place? Or even worse, why doesn't anyone come and look after it? I mean, if this would be in real life, and the baby was crawling around in the middle of the night in a cemetery, almost getting clawed to death by drugged cats or getting kicked by skeletons. Ready, Ike? Kick the baby! Don't kick the goddamn baby! Kick the baby. Ah. I don't think that its parents would get the Parent of the Year reward exactly. Well, it's not the worst game, but it's still pretty much success. Like a diaper full of baby turds. Well, that fucking sucked, but I won't give up until I find a game where we can kill some babies. Oh, that sounded horribly wrong. But you get it. Well, I think we should bring in some expert help to help us find the right game for this purpose. Yo, man. Hey, Mike, what you up to? Uh, nothing much in here. Giving birth to a brown baby. <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, speaking of babies, do you know any game that includes some part where you can actually kill a baby in a game? <laughs> Dude, what the fuck is wrong with you? Why would you want to do that? Yeah, yeah, I know it's terribly wrong, but it's just an experiment. Come on, help me out now. Uh, fine. Okay, go, go find a game called Shabby Share. Uh, it's probably the worst game in the world, but I believe you're some kind of a baby and the goal is to get killed or something. Uh, chubby cherub. You are a chubby cherub. But okay. Thanks for the tip. Talk to you soon. Yeah, yeah whatever. See ya. I'm fucking idiot. Oh my god, it comes to sell the sandwich! Hmm. Chubby cherub. Where do I recall that from? Hmm. Anyway, what the fuck is a chubby cherub? I wonder what it looks like. Seriously? <laughs> well, I played this game once before, and before getting started to rip the game a new asshole, I must wonder, did anyone even test play this game before releasing it? The whole game is almost like a big glitch, and nothing makes any sense. First of all, let's get clear what a cherub or cherub is. Well, my research concludes that it's a higher angel with four faces. A human, a lion, a bull, and an eagle face. Well, does this character look anything like that? This is what it should look like if you go by the Bible. And this is what it is for now. As for me, it could even look like this guy, and it still wouldn't make more sense. But anyway, I'm getting off track. I don't really understand the game ball and what's happening, but as I understand, you are a little angel going around collecting fruits and letters in boxes, and try to stay away from rabies disease dogs that also bark letters. What's up with that? Real awesome animation guys, or not? And why the hell does the character's face look like a Canadian when he's picking up or eating a power-up or a fruit? Hey, fuck you, buddy! When you get to the end of the level, you need to open windows and find a guy or a boy. And when you do that, the level is cleared. Makes sense, right? Nothing will explain what or why you need to do this. The worst thing about the game is the controls. You're really slow when you walk and jump. You can fly and shoot, but it only seems to work sometimes when the game itself wants it to work. And when you shoot your heart at enemies, it reaches them in the same distance they can reach you with their attacks. So half the time, when you try to shoot the enemy, they hit you at the same time so you both die. That is so crappy that I don't even bother to kill them, but instead just fly my way through the stage. But as I said, sometimes it doesn't let you to do that. I guess it has to do something with some kind of fly meter or something, how much power-ups or fruit you collected. There are no continues in this game either, so... I got to the third stage, and then my senses just told me to give up. No way I'm wasting my time playing this filth. So sorry guys, I wanted to show you the end, but it's not worth the effort. Whatever you do, promise me, stay away from this game. This game is a disease. Well, that was the last time I listened to Mike. Apparently he doesn't know shit about any older games. So I figure out that maybe older games isn't the best games to look for. So let's check out some new games and see if we can find any game that is suitable for this purpose. Games. Let's see what do we have. Splatterhouse. Well that's a fucked up game. But I don't recall to have any babies in it or something like that, even if the game itself is equally entertaining like a puking elephant. So what else? Ah, oh, here it is. Dante's Inferno. Where to look for shit if not in hell. This got to be it. Let's check it out. Oh my god, this is the greatest game ever! How fucking sick is this? 
some intense play. Oh. It's hot in hell. Oh. Oh. I need to cool off. Yes, it's Alex. Oh, hey darling. What's up? You're what? Oh my god. Yeah, I'm super excited. That's amazing news. Yeah, of course. I'm, I'm super glad, so... Okay, I'll talk to you later. I gotta go work and film some shit. Man, woman, chill, um... Stuff to slaughter. Okay, see you. Bye. Oh my god! I'm gonna be a father! Oh, this is the best day of my life. I'm gonna let everybody know about this. He's gonna be the smartest kid. I'm gonna be so proud of him. Let's see, send to everyone on Facebook. Yeah. Oh, I also need to fix a blog about this so everyone can read about it. Um, also need to fix some photos. I had some new page. No, where's my camera? Mm. Oh yeah, oh my god. No, fuck this, screw it now. I'm done. Hey, babies.